Hello valued viewers, I hope you're doing wonderfully well and welcome back to the World War Z campaign, Matrix Send. Good evening everyone, welcome back to World War Z, trip number four. This is day number eight, sortie number two. Mission time is 1420. Mission synopsis, our missions over the last few days have been very successful and our advance has achieved all the objectives that our commanders have uh, set for us and we have consolidated our advance and we have ground forces have moved up to the front line to secure our position. All of this has been achieved with far fewer casualties and a lot more qu quickly than uh, our command anticipated and Intel have not provided any explanation as to why this should be so, beyond rather overestimating Russian separatist capabilities. In particular, the reported use of the opioid, opioid crocodile in combination with biological enhancements of separatist, separatist infantry has not yet been encountered as expected. The only time in our campaign so far that we've encountered such troops was reported by the uh, CSAR Huey crews involved in the rescue of the downed F-15 crew two days ago. During the embarkation, they were attacked by estimated three platoons of strength of infantry, described as advancing at a sprint, firing wildly with little regard for our defensive fire. Consequently, the enemy casualties are very high, but the CSAR mission only narrow escape being overrun by the infantry, described pithily by the crew involved as crazed zombies. Now that our advance has achieved the objectives, our missions have switched from offensive to defensive and consolidation. General staff do not intend further advances by our ground forces, and our own air forces assume patrolling duties until further notice, pending further political developments. It's anticipated that Russian separatists, whose campaign has suffered severe setbacks, will attempt to negotiate a ceasefire pending a permanent settlement and withdrawal of forces generally. Until such time that a negotiated settlement is achieved, Allied forces must remain alert for any incursion by Russian separatist forces. To date, our intel staff are rather concerned that operations have not met the expected resistance and are concerned that the enemy may be preserving their forces for an offensive in the near future. Intel have also noted significant air transport movements from the northwest into Krasnodar and Makop. Significant he transport helicopter and ground convoy activity has also been noted from these enemy air bases towards the front line, indicating that the enemy is gathering a major force for an anticipated counterattack. Counter so, whilst we remain on the defensive and consolidation posture, we are to remain vigilant as an attack may be imminent. So, moving on to the map, you can see the disposition of our forces, ground forces to the left, and the enemy as expected to the east. So, you see the airfields at Krasnodar and at Makop, and you can see that some of the, there's some concentrations of enemy ground forces and air forces in uh, and around those air bases. Okay, moving on to flights, forward flight, four F-15s available with the usual array of uh, kit, one fuel tank, four CBU-87, and some air intercept missiles as well. Primary target is a line search uh, for a convoy proceeding from Makop towards Krasnodar city itself. The route is in and you should line search between waypoints 8 and 13 for the uh, enemy convoy. Once you've found and destroyed the enemy convoy, proceed uh, towards MACOP and take out any uh, assets, enemy assets you see at the airfield. After that, proceed home and recover. Uh, the photo below shows uh, some IL-76s gathers, gathered on the apron at the southern part of the airfield. Moving on to Pontiac, <clears throat> this is much more of a consolidation pat patrol with combat air patrol overhead the uh, enemy lines. And your loadout this evening is two fuel tanks 4AIM-7, uh, 4AIM-9L. If you can see, find enemy transport aircraft inbound to the previously mentioned airports, feel free to attack those. Otherwise, look out for enemy fighters. Uh, we're not considering those too high a threat. But, of course, enemy transport and ground attack helicopters uh, are also targets of opportunity. Moving on to Hornet. F-18, this is swing roll this evening, taking off from the carrier. Proceeding towards uh, Krasnodar to provide some uh, suppression of enemy air defences and also with some uh, CBU-99s to attack ground targets once the primary objective has been achieved. Moving on to Peugeot. Forgot Python. Oh, yeah, we have forgotten Python. Moving back to Python. Python, four F-16s fitted for seed, four harms, two AIM-120C, two AIM-9X, harm targeting system and fuel tank. Take off from uh, Anapa, fly around the route, provide seed cover over Krasnodar as there are uh, enemy SAM radars at both airfields that need to be uh, taken out. So primary target for you is enemy SAM radars, as mentioned. Secondary target, enemy air assets, as there will be some in the area. Moving on to Peugeot, uh, Mirage 2000, one fuel tank, four magics and cannon rounds. Uh, this is a fighter sweep for enemy transport and attack helos operating just behind the uh, front line. So 
stay at low level and uh, in particular look for enemy transport helicopters believed to be transporting troops and equipment to the front line. Threats to you, Russian MiG-23, MiG-21 is less of a threat, but you've also got SA-3, AAA and MEN pads. Moving on to PIG, A-10, two types of Maverick, CBU-97 and of course your gun, two sidewinders and targeting pod and the uh, ECM. Classic uh, close air support behind enemy lines, take out as much in the way of enemy ground forces that you can, particularly targeting tanks and armour. Also, there will be some enemy infantry and other soft targets, take those out as a secondary target. Threats, man pads, SA-3, AAA, MiG-23 and MiG-21 to a lesser degree. Moving on to Enfield, Harrier GR-7 taking off from Invincible. Proceed around the, uh, the route and your target is again a line search for a convoy moving into a reinforced Galenzik. You're equipped with two uh, LEU-3 HE, four CBU-99, two AIM-9 Lima and of course cannon rounds. Once you've destroyed the primary target of the convoy, could be anywhere along that route, uh, take out enemy ground forces behind the uh, front line as requested. Again, threats to, for you are very similar, particularly AAA and man pads, and to a lesser extent the MiG-23. Moving on to Volvo for Vigans, equipped this evening with one fuel tank, two AIM-9 Sidewinder, 16 Hydrag bombs. Uh, your target is to take out any enemy transport assets air transport assets at Krasnodar Pashovsky. And the picture down below shows you three IL-76. It's also believed that there are some at Krasnodar Center as well. So if you manage to destroy all the targets at Pashkovsky, please proceed to center and take out the enemy, enemy transport there. Again, threats for you are as before, you've got more of the uh, SAMs like SAM-3 and you may, be, may encounter some SAM-6s in the Krasnodar area as well, along with AAA. Moving on to Thunder. There's nobody flying Thunder tonight, so I won't bother to brief that. Moving on to Uzi. Huey's based at Novorossisk, and you're equipped with two door-mounted machine guns and two 19-round Hydra rocket pods with HE warheads. Uh, no transport for you tonight. This is more a um, patrol and close air support mission. So proceed behind enemy lines and shoot up anything you uh, see in terms of enemy forces. Again, threats for you, man pads, AAA, not so much the SA-3, maybe MiG-23, but also enemy helicopters if you come across them. Moving on to Pale Horse. For Apaches, uh, you may want to check your data link because I haven't had time to set them up. But you're equipped with uh, 16 Hellfires. Again, if you want to change the uh, loadout, you can do. Currently, you're equipped with four laser guided, sorry, eight laser guided, eight radar, and longbow radar with 1200 rounds of 30mm HEDP. So please feel free to swap those out. Again, close air support for you. Proceed behind enemy lines around the route and take out armour with a priority and enemy, any other enemy ground forces uh, as a secondary target. Again, the threats for you, man pads, AAA, to a lesser extent the SAMs, but possibly MiG-23 and particularly enemy helicopters. If you can take out enemy helicopters at airborne, that'll be a great help as well. Moving on to Chevy. I think we've only got one person flying the Mi-24 tonight, but if others turn up, Again, very similar. Fly around the route. You're going around clockwise this time, slightly to the north. Same for you. Uh, attack enemy ground forces in the uh, area of operations just behind the enemy line. Again, take out armour if you can find any. Uh, SAM systems if you can as well, or AAA. And enemy infantry and other soft skin targets as a secondary target. Again, threats for you. Man pads, AAA. Uh, lesser extent, these SAMs. Uh, but also enemy helicopters. If, again, for you, if you can take down any, any enemy helicopters, that would be a great help. Right, I'll do the flights then. Ford, F-15E, Cap and Simba has not turned up. Bean, Pontiac, F-14, Jigsaw, Python, F-16, Milo, Fire, Signori, Elo, Hornet, Matrix, Harath, Cover, Peugeot, Mirage, Space Chef, Bendy, Enfield, Harrier, Poosh, Tuxor, Volvo, Vigan, Blood, Jaffers, Stoat, Uzi, Huey, Lucky, Shrak, Pale Horse, Apache, Skill, Kelso, Tanky, Red, Chevy, Me24, Polite. Welcome in viewers to the campaign. In case you don't know this campaign, it's relatively relaxed. Our F10 map is set to Fog of War, which means we will see hostiles that are AWACSs. Do we have an AWACS? There we go. Which are none at the time. Hopefully that gets populated. I usually have Simba with me flying the plane and I can kind of ride along and 
look up the map uh, and show you what's going on in the battle but he's not turned up today so I'm gonna have to try and just do the best I can today we're in an F-15E um, yeah I don't know about you Cap I'm gonna take more bombs more uh, you know what who says that my friggin baby more 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 boom boom da da <laughs> Yerp. Um, setting up these uh, bombs. Eight, we've got 87s. 87s are hopeless. Should we change them for 97s, do you think? Yeah, I'm taking uh, six 87s and I think uh, six of those. 109 are common. Why not 97s? Because the 87s are anti infantry and we're not fighting infantry, you know. Yeah, because um, one is like the rock on and it is like pucks, isn't it? Roger. Well, I'm changing the 97 anyway. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm taking both. Right, let's go and see what's going on out here. So, we've got Mirage is doing Mirage things. Wigan's doing Wigan things. I changed my mind cap, I'm taking 12 97s. F16's doing F16 things. Apache's doing Apache things. F18's doing F18 things. And about traffic. Persia flight lining up on runway G2. And F 14s doing F 14 things. Mirage has taken off. Mirage has taken off B. Someone's forgot to put their wheels up. What a silly well, runway. Well, uh, hang on, I've got to wait for this old man to work out to set his new weapons up. Viewers, while I was watching things, I uh, rearmed with lots more bombs, many more bombs. So we've got to go and remember how to set them out now. So here, here. Sixteens gone up. Right, so I've selected, I've put the CBUs in the CBU slots, right? Or I've been, that was a bit of a mare, but I think I've remembered how to set my bombs up. Are you ready? Yep. Let's go. And then if you want the full runway, you go right again at the end. Take us down to the threshold. Oh, bugger. I just missed it. Even though you said it, I missed it. I just got what you meant. I think we're going to do it on a reduced runway, B. What's the worst that can happen? I don't see anything that could happen. Everyone's taken off. We're running so late. Everyone's taken off. We're, we're fine. Don't like using your brakes, I see, B. <laughs> They're not very good. I guess I'll just go then. Okay. Let me have a look at today's route or route for our uh, American friends. All right, steer point two punched in, 40 miles. On heading to steer point two. Loads of guys on the on the scope. I'm pretty sure they're not going to be hostile. Uh, push uh, 243. Yeah, are you uh, headed towards Galenzik area? Roughly, I'm just trying to intercept the um, transport lights. Okay. We're just kind of waiting for you to get in that area before we press down. Getting some air speed yes, back. Good, I've telling you. It's good that it's AB following the cloud. My picture is basically clear, so I don't have any of the aircraft at those points, but um, in detail. Oh, Simba's turned up. Look at that, viewers. Station on left, if you can. Roger, Simba's just turned up, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna be a bit funny for a minute. Hello. Hello, Simba. Better late than never, I say. Alright, you chose a yeah. uh, good day to turn up because my stomach is effing destroying me today so I'm going to hand it, uh, flight right over to you because I can barely concentrate. Uh, take control when you're ready, Simba. I'm going to go and check on the map what's going on. So, we've got these guys out here. Who's that? F-16s? That's 
kind of cool. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at those hostiles starting to show up. Uh, just some generic cargo planes on the go. And that's myself and Simba doing stuff. What else have we got? We've got some Harriers doing Harrier things. Oh, people are firing at someone. All right, missiles out already. That is a missile from a Mi-24. And it has gone 100% done. We've got some Hornets doing Hornet things. Probably seed work. F-14, pretty much our only air cover today as far as I can see. Uh, where are those Wigans? Where are the Wigans? They probably haven't taken off yet. Oh, another missile bomb dump. Uh, unsure about the bandit situation, but the uh, AWACS is going a bit mental, so just keep an eye on that. F-16s going tactical by the looks of it. Oh, uh, that is a hard Lucky one. Space Chef, come check. 3 deal. Uh, Magnum SA2. Missiles from helicopters shooting stuff. Missing a lot. Oh no, it's a man. Look, there's a man there. <laughs> Silly man. Magnum SA6. Pop. Something all blown up. Another Sam destroyed. Ooh. Another Sam destroyed. Ooh. Shack SA2, Shack SA6. Looking very handsome there, Bean. Ah, uh, you too, Cap. Hmm. Seems I'm not so sure. Huh. See where we are, viewers. We are at steer point four, pretty much. Got a ways to go yet. Yeah. More Mi-24 missiles from someone, one of our guys, against a BMP-1. Something. Aha! Vegans are up. Me 24 missiles. Pop. What are F 16s up to? Uh, I believe we should be going left to waypoint 5, correct? Stand by. Uh, you got it, but you can pretty much skip 5, Simba, because it's, uh, it's so close. Just go to 6. Phoenix is out. Missile to space. Right, the, Phoenix, uh, the F-14 is firing over our head pretty much. Where is it? Over there somewhere. Oh, what's that? Flogger. Box 2, MiG-23. Woohoo! F-16s merged with floggers. Ignore Cap, you guys emerge with floggers. Copy, we're engaging. Splash one MiG-23 a uh, minute ago. Roger. All right, two more sit points to go, Simba, and then we've got to start looking for bad guys. Roger. F-16 shooting down floggers. Pop. Matrix called for you. On what column? Oh. I'm not sure. Uh, is someone trying to reach cap on guard? 243. 16, buddy, spike. I'm gonna just ignore it. Loud and clear on 243. Yeah, those vloggers are not a threat, Simba, on the U2s. They're, um...
their F-16s are all over them. I think, viewers, this is an Apache trying to shoot down other bad helicopters with Hellfire missiles, which is interesting. But he's not having a good day out there. Fox 3, MiG-23, spot. Uh-oh, Apache's getting swamped. Um, which steer point are we at, Simba? Out of cockpit. Uh, we are past seven on the way to eight. Oh, 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 shot down. Yeah. I guess he's dead. Wow. Go on, Elo. Go on, Elo. Shoot that stupid flog, flog. Oof. We better start concentrating on ourselves now. What is Phoenix's mister? Bean cap. Go ahead, cap. Uh, we are pretty much at steer point eight, so I guess we descend below the clouds and look for the convoy, right? Yeah, copy that. We've got teapots as well, which we can stick on the waypoints and have a look around. Roger, roger. Oh, we still need to be below the cloud. I mean, look at the cover, right? Yeah, for sure. Yep. So you take us below and have a look at the teapot timber. Boom! We've got some ballistic missiles viewers, look at that. I'm a ballistic phoenix. Ooh. Magnum SA-10 and Big Bird. Nice. Right, I'll start doing my job. Oh shit, what's that? That's an SA-10, Simba, but... I don't know the... Where is it? Visual... No, no visual. Get nice and low, break his line of sight. Bean, Bean, are you getting trouble low, from SA-10? Low, altitude. I'm just getting nailed at the moment. Roger, we got spiked, but I don't know where it is or how close it is, so we just be careful with it. Copy that. Simba, Simba, Simba. 11 o'clock helicopter hostile. 11 o'clock helicopter hostile. Doesn't matter, he's not a threat. And he's not on mission either. Uh, right, where did we get to Simba? Once we've um, beaten the missile symbol, we need to get back on our waypoint chain, find a road, and try and find the convoy on that road. Yep. Turn him back to the waypoint chain. I can see uh, F-16s above us sending anti-radiation missiles out on the SA-10, so I suspect that will be neutralised relatively soon. Bean, we've beaten the missiles and we're heading back to the waypoint chain to do uh, to look for the convoy. Copy that. I'm just by waypoint eight at the moment. Yeah, we're just behind you now. Shack S300. Thank you, Signore. That was giving us trouble. No problem. We're taking out the site right now. They seem to be good at the harm. Yep. All right. S300 dealt with, Simba. Cap, but not. Yeah. Imminent vegan awesomeness. We're just approaching our ingress point now. Good call. Give them hell, boys. I only can friggin' find them. All right, you're looking for these things between 10 and 11? Uh, they are between 8 and 13. 8 and 13. The vehicle's on a road, presumably. All right, we're coming back to waypoint 10. Yeah. I think that might have been our road. Yeah, it's going to get laggy, a bunch of uh, cluster munitions are about to land, so just stay safe for a minute. Alright viewers, I'll give you whatever this is, I can't even remember what it is now. It's a Swedish uh, dispersal glide bomb of some kind. Huh, that's kind of impressive. Oh, the entire airport just blew up. How about that viewers?
Yes, that was rather nice, Figgins. We aim to please. But if you absolutely got to destroy everything on the airfield, viewers, I'll give you whatever the hell just happened. Huh. Alright, Simba, I'm back doing my job again now. Um, right, so is that 10 in front of us? Yes. Roger. Bean, what have you found? Nothing yet, Cap. I'm proceeding to 12. Alright, Simba, that's going to be a right to 11 now, right? Yep. I think I'm overflying this road. So it must be that road going right 90 degrees. Yeah, this long Roman road. Hey, Fran. That's 11 on our nose. The road is clear. All right, 12 on the nose. Follow us around to the right, I guess. I see blue smoke off in the distance at our one o'clock. Roger, probably nothing to do with us. Okay, Beam, we're approaching a stiff point 12. No sighting. Yeah, copy that. I haven't seen anything yet. I'm on to 13. Roger, we're turning onto 13 now. So it's going to be a right pull along the, one of those roads on the right. Their beam must be just ahead of us. Found something on the teapot, just trying to clear it up. Is that found it? Bean, I found it. I found it. I found it. I'm just gonna mark it. Stand by on the nose. Do you see him, Simba? If for him. don't bomb him here, you need to get more altitude and dive down. There's CBU 97 non aerodynamic bombs. Also, watch out for the AAA, etc. I don't know what they're equipped with, so get safe. AAA, AAA. Bean, I don't know how to mark them, but we're over them pretty much. Yeah, which way point are you at, Cap? Between 12 and 13. Simba padlock them, don't lose them. Copy that. I guess I'll see the smoke when you do your first run. You've got to drop, I've set the fuses at 1200 feet AGL, so you've got to drop them moderately high. Oh, uh, I know what road they're on. Roger, they are on our three o'clock yep. on that main road. You've got yep. to right, dive in, but you've got yep. to do it quite steep. They're not slick bombs, they're non aerodynamic. Running in from the rear. I am not getting the bomb fall uh, line. Yeah, Leave it to me. Give it to me, Simba. Give it to me. Yep. yep. Hit Questing. G. Going off target. I think mine's working. All right, viewers. My turn. Thank you, Simba, for getting me here. Just trying to keep them padlock padlocked in case I lose them in the clouds. Running in from the front. One out, two out, three out, four out, five out, six out. Let's see if that any of those fuse. First one in. Summer's blowing up. Yep. Oh, that's beautiful. Simba, can you take control of the plane, please? You've got control, yep. I got control. Well, I certainly did something. Uh, uh, the Convoy is down and we're headed home. Runner boys. I also did a thing on a convoy. Look at that viewers, that's one F-15 did that. I don't know how many I've just flown, flown up. Who's that stealing our thunder? Bloody Bing. Hornets! No, there's Hornets in it. Right, just stay safe while this lag. It's obviously going to be laggy for a while. I'm blowing like 100 units up. Are you doing a second run in, Cap? I'm not sure there's any point doing a second run. I'd say there's half a dozen units, but maybe... Yeah, go on in, why not? Yeah, I'm just going in for that middle grouping, just off to one side of the road. Roger, I'm going to watch you in that case. Oh, a bit of ground fire there. There's a enemy helo near Crimp. Uh, 
uh, just north of Crimson, near the lake. Well, I hate to say it, and I don't get to say this very often, but we couldn't really have done that much better, guys. Boys, next mission is to get to Makeup. I don't know the steer point, so I'm going to go and try and find out. We'll be bombing targets of opportunity there. Yeah, I'm Winchester camp, so... Uh... Oh, you're Winchester? Yep. Roger, admit, uh, let me check my state. Yep, we are too. Winchester? Oh, we're Winchester too. I guess we're RTB then. Stick base in and off he goes, Simba. How about that? I didn't mean to drop that many. Maybe they dropped in pairs. Uh, Simba, fly above Angels 20, please. One thing I remember about this campaign is he's put loads of man pads on there. Just took Mario, my handiwork, and the teapot. Lots of destruction today, viewers. Lots of destruction. Somebody is coming in for whatever reason. We're just going RTB. I think so, Simba. Um, and we can either do that or we can go and gun, gun some targets. Um, what would you rather do? Oh, it's up to you. I mean, we have 1,600 and a half pounds. 16, or 16,000 and a half. Roger. In that case, uh, why don't we go and clean up what we've just bombed? Do you, do you know the way back? Yeah, go and, go and gun it. On the nose now. Yeah, you got it. There it is. Uh, in fact, it may even be designated as a target. That's not. But there's some baddies there. Um, go and see Chris traffic fire dead. Right base for final or runway. Landing. Two to one, two two. Sorry, dears. There's just too much going on for me to follow it all. Alpha, speed. Send for speed. Speed to what frequency I can't say necessary. Uh, what? Uh, isn't a huge one, he's got two to five something to do on the pilot stick? Uh, you're absolutely right, of course. Um, you're gonna have to hand it back over to Timber. Yep. Right, um, now that said, I can't actually remember how to do it. Um, you'll be glad to know. Uh, do you remember how to do it, how to select the mode? There's some fancy switchology to do with uh, Bean. Yeah. I've gone back to attack some, because I've got loads of fuel, I've gone back to strafe some, some units at the convoy. Do you remember how to select uh, guns edge ground mode? It's some weird switchology I remember. No, sorry. Dang it. I got a gun, but the question is now, how do we get soy to the you have to get soy to the HUD, don't you? How do we do that? Sensor select, it's working. Is it up long? Okay, that's definitely not the way to select the cannon because it refers me back to uh, air to air mode, so that can't be right. Bollocks, we can't unselect a weapon. How do I unselect a fucking weapon? Um, oh, we might not have to do anything. Uh, it's, it's, it's TDC. So here's the problem I've got. I, I selected the guns yeah. for air to air mode, just to, maybe that would work, but now I'm stuck in air to air mode unless I deselect the yeah, weapon. Yeah, so Which I have no oh, idea. call them on either. guard, you can probably nuke it for us. Okay. I think that's a coolie hat. Raft, blood knock. There is one transport still remaining. Uh, can you go back to air to ground or is it still giving you the. I stuck in air to air, but Simba, I've got a genius idea. That's fired by the tracer. Okay. Uh, can you. I've lost the. Do you know where it is? The convoy. Uh, keep coming around left. Sorry viewers, I can't remember how to get the air to ground gunnery working. It's a puzzle in itself. Low altitude. Yeah, Low I got some. Suck that down, baby. Two down. Uh oh, cloud. Right, we need to try and spot. There's a guy that's firing back at us. I need to try and spot him. It's very dark down there, it's hard to see. You see the fire that we've just made? Uh, not through the clouds. It's 
right of the nose by about 10 degrees. There's a fire on the road. And there's yep. a unit shooting just from the right of that. I think I see them. Yep, got them. One. Man, that's hard to see. That is basically invisible. Oh, he's just got back on the road. Oh, isn't that convenient? How about that? I saw him a minute ago. There he is. I see him. He's back on the road. Right. I'm going to forget a runner. What's our fuel? 15,000. Right, who's firing at us? It was him. Yeah. All right, I think we pushed our luck in by trying to snipe um, BMPs, BTRs without a proper gun sight is only going to end one way. Take control of the bird, slightly out of trim because of that hit. I've right. been to Cap if you're bored of straight from this and IL 76 transports at 12,000 feet off your 5 o'clock. Simba! I got something beautiful for us. Um, you probably won't be able to do it without the sight, but immediate. Look behind us if you can. Yeah, they're about on our six, six miles now. Five miles on our six, co altitude, transport planes waiting to be boom boomed. If we've got any ammo left. Uh, you got two 120s and two 9 mics. Oh, you're kidding me. That is just friggin' unreal. Right, uh, let me get that S all spooted up. Right, AMRAMs selected. Looking for bad guys. Oh, bad guys found. That is just so convenient, Simba. Locking. Are they in the... They're, they're right on our nose, firing now. Box three. Um, just trust me, they're literally sitting on our nose. Right, I'm going to try and select another one now. That is what we say, tray convenient. Right, why can't I see them? They must be in a notch. Locking another one now. Box three, sidewinders. Waiting to see which ones the AMRAMs hit. Uh, have you got a visual on them? I'm just looking at them through the hood. I'm about to start firing sidewinders, just waiting for Wes. I'm on the second to the right, second to the right, I'm locked. Just waiting for Wes. And. Uh, go to the ones on the. Doesn't matter, carry on, carry on. Just choose whatever you want, I'll shoot whatever you want. Box two. Come on, lock that son of a bitch. Box two. Guns, guns, guns. Splash, there's one left on the left, left, left. Uh, left high. Uh, left 20 degrees. And this is weird, you have a U flyer and me shoot, but it's also kind of sick. In the colloquial sense. Right, I've got 40 bullets, so we've got to get a perfect shot on him. Can you see the pipper? I think so. All right, I'm going to wait until we're, you know, right on top of him, obviously. This is weird. Simba's aiming the jet. I'm firing the gun. This will be great if we kill this guy. Right, I'm waiting, 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 I'm waiting. Right, when you're ready. Got him, but I'm out of ammo. <laughs> All right, take us back home, Simba. We got him, Bean, we got him. Nice. My viewers, that's about as much stuff as we can kill on one run, I'm afraid. I think we could about 40 ground units and at least two cargo planes. Oh, I'd say that might be a third. I'd say that might be a third. Shot his engines off. He's not going anywhere. Oh, this one's not faring a great deal better. We're so mean. We're so mean. Oh, I see he's jumped on the chat. He's upset that we shot down defenseless Antonovs. More Ilyushins. Yeah, Ilyushins. That was great fun. I mean, we didn't shoot down cows. We didn't. Look at us having some very rare fun. This is great news. Right, viewers. That's Mon and Simba's job done. We're just going to take us home now and uh, do some things. Oh, Ooh. Bean's playing silly buggers with the 
uh, the uh, AGS 37s. They'll go out for another run, but I think we're done. Are you back in the cockpit, Cap? Uh, yes, why? Uh, turn the jettison select knob uh, just to combat and then yeah. press and hold jet. What have you done? You done fuel tank. There, yep, yeah. now press and hold again. Ah, trying. A button is hard to get to. I got one job and that's to push the button. I can't do it. I can't. Why is everything uh, so hard in this jet? Being button. I'm trying. Yes. I am trying. Put it back. Put Please. it back off and then back to jettison select. I, I do not know who is this beam you speak of. Well, I'm not sure about this beam, but whatever it's lunatic is currently flying over uh, a Napa. Are you able to hold off landing for just a so moment? so retarded, I can't actually click yeah, the button. No hold it still, sir. Yeah, we're just taking off now. About. Oh, beam's landing. Oh, the Wigans are going up again. Ich bin ein Wigan. Can you be any higher? 46,000 feet. Ich bin ein frigging F-15. And 1.7. Huh. Well, I did want to get back in a hurry, so I guess it kind of fits, right? 1.8. Oh, I've locked someone by accident. Who am I locking? I have annoyed... Milo, the Irish wonder. Milo, you got your friggin' air brakes out, Irish wonder. Cap? Not listening. Yes? How does it feel to be going Mach 2 but not in control of the airplane? Uh, I'm alright, I think. I've been trapped. Hello, Bean, can I help you with something? Yeah, were there any uh, aircraft left at that secondary target or did you go? We never went to secondary target. You're welcome to go, but my stomach is about to kill me, so we're going to land and lock. Yeah, no worries. I'll be around for the debrief, but I'll uh, we have a punt at that target. Oh, that's one way to cross the game board, Simba. Yeah, I said it. Game board. We're going to go right over the Wigans. I wonder if they can see us. They can. They can see us. The Wigans can see us. Look at us. We're like a friggin' meteor. We've just proved that the Earth is indeed 3D, viewers. And 3D, as you all know, is best D. Into the soup once more. Oh, look at that, Simba. A nice big runway. Fresh breeze in that hair that you don't have. You could also use some gear and flaps. You want some gear? Ah, needy, I see. Okay, flaps are deployed. Gear is traveling and deployed. Land the vehicle. Oh, there's an F 16 in formation with it. Did he remove his canopy? No, so I'm not happy about it. Cap Bloodlock, uh, more vegan awesomeness inbound. Roger, ETA? Uh, we're about 50 kilometers from the target, so I'll know in the next two minutes. Roger, I'll check in shortly. Speed brakes out. Speed brakes deployed. Wow, oh, look at that big old speed brake. All right. Hi, F-15. Whoa, did not see that coming at all. Thanks for that, Bean. Thanks for waiting. Right, the Wigans wanted me to go and watch a thing. Cap, looks like you need help with that fire coming out of your wing. 
that's fine. Sagan, Jigsaw, waypoint six. Cap Blood not commencing attack in the next 20 seconds. Yeah, I'm watching. Definitely do something. Oh, there's something as a target over there, look. Yep, it's going to do something. Oh, they've missed. They've missed. Oh. Hang on. You know when I said they missed? I lied. Ooh! <laughs> the whole airfield just went! The whole airfield just went up. Ladies and gentlemen, the Swedes! We're really good at blowing stuff up. Alright, Cap, I have found you a parking spot befitting the size of My your status. head. Perfectly formed. All uh, right, all that's done. All that crap done. These will be pretty much unserviceable because they would have all have been hit by shrapnel, as you can see. God knows what they hit over there. They hit something. Very nice. Very nice, boys. Um, you can get your comms back into debrief while you RTB. Oh, trap firing. I like that. Oh, he gave us a he gave us a nice touring car nudge timber. Whoops, I ejected you into a solid wall. How embarrassing of him. First flight was myself and Bean and Simba uh, eventually in the F-15s. We took off and we uh, found that convoy we were specified to found, find. I found it on my teapot in the end, so I'm quite happy about that. Um, we bombed it with all of our CBUs on the pretty much the first run and killed about 40 units, which I'm super happy with. Uh, finished up with some guns. Uh, RTB'd on the way we shot down... Uh, four Ilyushins, which was nice and conveniently placed and then went home and been still out there doing the secondary target but I'm too tired I couldn't stay in any longer uh, that's us uh, next flight please Jigsaw Wesley I tried to take out some of the uh, transport flights unfortunately none of my missiles connected so I decided to hunt some helicopters and uh, managed to crash into one of them ah. good one uh, Python next F-16s yeah, uh, we had a busy night. We got off, uh, flew over the front lines, uh, immediately got spiked by SA-3s, took that down. Then we, for bonus points, took out an SA-10 site, got it by SA-6s, spent it all our harms, uh, went back, landed at, uh, I think, was it Krimsk? Uh, Rearm for air-to-air, -air, went off, took out a few transports, took out a few helos, and came home. Everyone survived, including Sig, who ate a man pad, but was kindly picked up by one of the uh, friendly mil 24s uh, yeah. don't forget we got jumped by those big 23s as well and shot them all down oh yeah right was productive good um f-18s that was uh, matrix harath and cover yeah we took off the boat climbed up to medium level we were intending to do some seed near uh krasnodar but it seemed like the f-16 guys were covering that quite nicely turned towards makeup to provide some seed cover for the f-15s doing their thing Picked up uh, a load of transport helicopters leaving makeup for the front line. So we tangled in amongst those. I think we all claimed a few. And there were some Aleutians taking off as well, so we claimed some of those as well. And there was some AAA over makeup. Uh, I had some CBUs left, so I'd seen the F-15s visually. I saw them drop their bombs on the convoy, and they gave it an absolute pasting. It was a really nice thing to see. So I added my cluster bombs to that, and I think the convoys are right off. Um, that was me, Winchester. I headed back to the boat. I think Harith and Cover both had some fun with some uh, enemy aircraft as well, and they claimed a few. Uh, yeah, uh, Jigsaw's just landing, so I'll take it. Uh, Peugeot Flight, um, Mirages, we, we flew out. Uh, sorry, Space Shift's just landing. Um, uh, we, Space Shift did a good job taking us there. We got shot down in about five seconds of arriving at the AO. Um, so we jumped in a pair of Hueys, um, headed out to Waypoint 2. I took a, a man pad to the face, but um, thankfully Space Chef took that out, a couple of uh, ground troops as well, headed up to Waypoint 3. Waypoint 4, we cleared that out as well, and we're just landing back at Novorossic. 
So Enfield, the Harriers, so it's Tux one Push, took off from Invincible, and it went low level through the hills. Um, a couple of Iglers hit Push, but managed to uh, shake them off. Found the convoy, and um, we pretty much killed all of them, apart from one or two that was in the bushes that we couldn't see. And then uh, just made it back to a carrier, no problems. Wow, remarkably good from everyone. Next flight, please. Yep, so the Viggins, uh, our task was to destroy the aprons at Krasitar Pashkovsky. Um, so yeah, we took off, um, fairly uneventful flight, nice low level, and dropped all our BK-90s on the three ap- aprons. I think we got two of the transports. And then annoyingly on one of the aprons, all the convoy, uh, the trucks, we just narrowly missed, which is a bit annoying. Uh, we then reattacked against Krasadar Center, where I think we had a lot more success. Uh, took out two SAM sites and I think a bunch of aircraft, though I've not confirmed how many we took out yet. Yeah, well, I checked, and although a lot weren't blown up, they had shrap- shrapnel marks in them, so they're yeah, as good as taken down. Yeah, uh, we just went with the with the Hueys and the uh, Mirages, so uh, Lucky and Shrak, I don't know if you've got anything to add. Um, lucky, I was shut down when I uh, was... Um, got past Krasnodar and then I followed the road up uh, north or northeast and I run into about 30 enemy and I'm still fighting them. Good man, keep going. Um, anyone else? Apache is, I think. Yep, skill. No? He's he's gone. Uh, Kelso, thank you, all red. All right, give up. Uh, next flight, please. Uh, just blight, if you said. Right. Oh, I'm here. Uh, hey, I took off from uh, Krimsk, headed north to Waypoint 1, rendezvoused with uh, Blue Convoy, and then took off east, Waypoint 2, took out Manpad and, and troops, um, uh, various vehicles, uh, AAA, and then uh, got a call to pick up Signore, who had been shot down. Hmm. So uh, went out, picked up Signore, brought him back to Krimsk, and dropped him off. Thank you. That was great. You're welcome. Well done. Uh, quick summary from Matrix. Yes, guys. Uh, I do hope you enjoyed that. I tried to provide a little bit of fun for everybody uh, uh, according to their uh, likes. And it seemed quite successful. Certainly what I saw was very good. And it'll be a slight change in next mission, but continuing along the development of this particular campaign. Well done. Good mission. I hope you enjoyed that, guys. I'll catch you all later. Later, Cap. Later, all. Yeah,